Oh my god, he punches! He punches! Let's go! <laughs> Hello, I am your Justin, and today it has been a month almost since we've had a new skin collection being the Oni 2.0 bundle. There's going to be an ultimate Oni collection coming out soon, but today we are focusing on the brand new collection, the Altitude collection, coming out in 2 minutes and 45 seconds. I'm going to snap my fingers, and we're going to be there. Psych! We're not going to be there. I have to put VP on my account, dude. Another day, another 100 bomb. Also, my mouse has not been charged in like three weeks. I have to charge it. So I'm going to charge it for two minutes and eight seconds. I'll see you guys there. Set my fingers now. All right, we got 10 seconds left. My mouse is going to charge for 10 more seconds. And hopefully it's going to last us for the entire video. We'll see if it does or not. But uh, yeah, four, three, two, one. And show me the buddy. Hello? Okay, I think I have to like move my mouse to like refresh it. Watch this. I'm gonna move my mouse. I'm taking off the charger right now. Watch. Okay, yeah, no, I guess it's just not coming out today. Store broke. Broken store. Help. Oh, okay. Well, I guess that kind of worked. Uh, was it because I backed out and went back to it? I don't quite know, but here we are, dude. Team Forge. What's that? These skins are pretty strange. Uh, they're kind of like joke skins. Not like a bad way by any means, but just look at this. They have like the little characters in them. I would like to think that they did intentionally make them look kind of plasticky. So that way they look like little figurines as opposed to just putting like the, you know, model in there in a, um, you know, not so talented fashion. But I do think it does look like the little toys that are inside of the guns. An interesting set nonetheless, though, and we are going to buy it right now. I love you guys, and I've missed you. Uh, it's been a while since we've just been able to talk. Um, so let's buy it. That was quick. Oh, yeah, I forgot. This comes with a pretty cool little buddy, too. This is a deluxe edition skin, as you can see right here. What is there to say about this collection, though? It's like airplane skins beats a collection that I don't have, and that is Aerosol from the very first battle pass. If it's not the very first, it's the uh, second battle pass. I can't remember which at this point. We haven't shown it yet, but there is a melee with this one. The melee itself is probably the star of the show here just because of how interesting it is. It's its own sort of unique object. It's like a literal unique melee being brass knuckles with a blade at the end of it. Um, I've always went on record. Like, I tweet about this constantly. I wish that they would just add in a melee that's just fist. And, like, if they're not going to add in fist, they should give us the brass knuckles. So that way, you know, we can do something that's literally melee. I think that would be really cool. They kind of did him dirty, dude. Like, he looks kind of scary in this. Like, honestly, it's like Drake meme. Here the buddy is. Well, favorite. I actually kind of really like this buddy. I don't know what it is about this. I just kind of like that it's, um, I don't know. It's like just like an actual tag. <laughs> Here's a funny joke for you guys. Watch this. Ha ha. Let's stop talking about all this stuff and just go and check it out in the range. Here we are in the range. These skins are essentially just agent skins with a little bit of flavor on them. Let's put them on here. Here they are. Here the buddy is. I really like the buddy a lot on this one. <laughs> the little uh, propeller spins. So that's interesting. In order to keep like um, keep it from being a distracting skin, the propeller spins at full speed, giving the illusion that um, it is at full speed when in actuality it just goes away so you don't see it at all. And the illusion is supposed to be that it's spinning at full speed. So here, watch it again. See, it slows down there. Back down. It speeds back up and just fades away. Pretty ingenious on, and creative, really, on the um, Riot team's part there. I like it. I dig it. Oh, dude, the ADS on this is wild. What? Okay, this is actually kind of fresh. I love this. Best ADS in the game. See, you reload to the propeller stops. Pretty interesting stuff. Uh, let's give the old sheriff a try. I, I really, really like this. They did a good, a good job with this. 5100 too. And again, I just want to stress this to you as well. We talked about in the beginning. Um, the actual little model of the person in there, it really does look like it's supposed to be a figurine. And I appreciate the little details like that that separate it from like an indie company that would just put the literal model in it and leave it up to us, the consumer, to be like, oh, it's just a toy in it. Like this actually kind of looks like a toy inside of it. I want to see the reload in slow motion. Cool. That'll look really cool when I'm editing this. Hi, me in the future. Here's a slow motion of what the bullets look like when you're firing, by the way. The bullets obviously match which color uh, the weapon that you're using is. So, you know, this is going to be green, obviously, as you can see inside of the uh, chamber there. 
Oh, who could forget the knife? Uh, no animations or nothing like that. I don't expect it, but it does look really cool in their hands nonetheless. Oh my god, he punches! He punches! Let's go! Oh my god. Oh, this is S tier. My favorite knife in the entire. What's up, dude? What's up? You gonna say something? You gonna say something? You're just gonna stand there, dude. You look like a little. I got pillow hands. I'm sorry. All righty. Let's put on the Odin. See what they got going on here. This thing is KO. Hello, KO. <laughs> that's actually really creepy. Is it always KO? Okay, yeah, no, that's super creepy. I, I was not expecting that in the slightest. I don't know why this would ever be there. Uh, Phoenix. Let's see. Can we get him in the brandish here? No, we can't. Yeah, so Phoenix is supposed to be on the front of this thing. Uh, very strange indeed. Let's fire it, though. Okay, this is... Oh, that's pretty cool. The bandolier or, like, the balls or whatever are um, actually little, uh, like, missiles. Like, bombs away type beat. You can see that on the top, there's, like, a little cockpit or whatever where, like, a quote-unquote gunner would be. So that's pretty interesting because that's where the sight comes out of. Yeah, so we have the raised Bucky here. People always tell me to make a raised collection. And I think that this is definitely going to help because it sort of puts together, like some kind of theme for rays like there's colors on here that are supposed to match her i guess neato but yeah i mean what really is there to say about this collection um i think it's pretty neat uh does it like really do anything it has the propeller on it and that's pretty cool as well as the view bottle is a little bit um close to obnoxious like i could definitely see somebody getting annoyed by like the little wings that are on this uh let's see it's present here on the vandal as well i could see this really annoying um vandal users when they have this sort of wing at the end that just hangs off it like that you're gonna get anything from this collection um we'll talk about it towards the end of the video we'll play some games here first but just like off the get-go if you're gonna get anything the melee might actually kind of be worth the cop just by itself but we'll see how this other stuff feels when we're using it let's hop into some games and see what these skins are all about and you're done. Spike plan is same thing. Oh, 89. Okay, so we basically got a frag with everything except for the melee. Um, everything is really cool in this one. I actually kind of quite like it a bit. Uh, you know, do let me know how you guys feel about this in the comments down below. Because I really, uh, you know, I don't know, like, specifically, because I'm not a competitive player myself. I just enjoy the game. But I do think that the, um, the higher-ups in the higher ranks who take this really seriously are going to not like the fins on the guns. So it's to be determined at that point. Uh, but should you get this collection? Should you get something from this collection? If I could absolutely recommend anything from this collection, I would say that the buddy itself is actually really cool. I like it a lot, especially if you're like a raise main or something, or maybe like a jet. This would be really cool to have on whatever it is that you're using. I just like how it looks. I like the simplicity of it. It's just a, you know, like a bag tag. Likewise, um, the melee is just really, really spectacular, really cool. And, you know, for free, you're getting the punch animation. Uh, I just like how it looks, but on top of the punch animation, you know, it's really good, high quality. I don't know how much this is by itself, but um, that's sort of my jurisdiction on this. It's good for agent skins. Uh, two things that you can get as any main in this are the buddy and the melee. Everything else, if you main that particular agent, maybe this is up your alley, but probably not because of stuff like the fins and things like that. Odin is the weakest part of this, and, uh, you know, do I recommend this? A little bit. Some things. 
Two out of six items is not that bad. One third of this stuff, good to go. Um, I love you guys, though. Thank you so much for watching. As always, I'm Justin Eater Not. Like the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. Subscribe anyways, even if you're not new. And click the bell for notifications so you do not miss a single video ever for anything Valorant related. I love you guys. I'll see you in the next one.